it's yours truly, the Trigger Trey here from the Good Old Killer Instinct Squad. Today we're playing some more of that The Walking Dead, A New Frontier. Today's episode, episode 4, Thicker Than Water. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Let's do this. Previously on The Walking Dead. No! You monsters! <laughs> You're a piece of work, you know that? Fucking Garcias! Oh. You. you. You shook my goddamn guts out. Hey, the Dark Moon Vortex, what's up? Joan was in on it. We did it on her orders. I'm... I'm sorry. It is too late for sorry, you backstabbing shitbag. I'll help you. I'll, I'll tell everyone in Richmond about this. We don't need your help. I'm begging you! <laughs> I'd hold it there, folks. And I'd consider explaining yourselves. I asked you to get Kate and Gabe safe, not tuck your tail and run. They were our family, David. How could you? Piece of shit! I'll give you family! Okay, here we go. This is where we left off at a gunfight. Strike one. I'm out of practice, that's all. Yeah, same here. I haven't held a bat since the league booted me. Well, you got all afternoon to get back in your groove. <sighs> oh yeah. Just holding this thing makes me feel better. You doing okay? Uh, I've been wrestling with something. Hey! Hey man, you're Javier Garcia, right? The ball player? Can I get your autograph? <laughs> if you could sign my baseball, that would be so awesome. So anything sure cool thing, kid. Oh man, thank you. Who do I make this out to? Oh, no, no, no names. Band player signatures are worth way more on resale than personalized crap. Just your name is fine. D don't date it or anything. So you got it. <laughs> <sighs> Hope you like it. Oh, yeah! I might get ten bucks for this! You gotta keep those fans happy, big star. That's just Let's get up. back to baseball. Oh, it's out of here! Holy cow! You just had to rub it in, didn't you? Does talking like that make you feel better? Yeah, you should try it. <sighs> Son of a bitch. Strike two. Man, knock that shit off. I'm serious. You just talk, talk, talk. It's annoying. I'm gonna say chill, Jeez, dude. You gotta learn to relax, David. What do you suggest? Put some money on it? You know I don't do that anymore. I still can't believe you actually wanted to come here. If I were in your situation, and avoid batting cages forever. Well, thanks for bringing me anyway. I needed the distraction. Oh, 
Ooh, Garcia's on fire! I think your ego's boosted plenty. Next time, we go to the shooting range. I don't really shoot. But I do. And I'm good at it. Ow. Oh, fuck. That had to hurt. You gotta shut up. Stupid thing. Garcia takes one for the team. That's gotta hurt. God damn it, Javi. I fucking warned you. I remember I showed you how to play this game. Well, let this superstar return the favor. Watch this. Oh my god, the crowd is going wild! I got it. You don't have to rub it in my face. I'm done. Oh, you gave up. David. I'm gonna say, wait, let's talk. David, what's wrong? Come back. I came here to reconnect. Instead, you just want to show me up. What's going on? David, I, I don't understand. You don't understand because you only think about yourself. And I'm sick of it. It's been that way for years. I'm gonna say, help You've me understand. You've always been looking out for yourself. You tried to help me. Yeah, let me help you. You really want to help? All right. Drive me down to the recruitment office next week. The army? My job sucks. Kate and I fight like cats and dogs. I belong back in the army. I had a purpose there. I had respect. I'm gonna say your family needs you. Last time you deployed, you didn't have kids. So, whatever you do now, you gotta put them first. I am putting them first. That's why I have to leave. Things between me and Kate have been going downhill for a while. But if I left, it seemed like that would be best for everyone. I can't keep pretending this is the life I want. I'm sorry, I won't stop anymore. you. I'm not gonna stand in your way. Well, all right then. I'm not gonna lie. If I go, it's gonna be hard on everyone. Kate may need help from time to time. You can help, right? You won't leave her hanging? I need to know that. I'm gonna say you can count on me. I'll be there for them, since you won't. If you want to go, you should go. <sighs> Thank you. I really mean it. We good? Yeah. We good. Come on. Let's get out of here. Buy your beer. No, I just drunk one. Ironically. Get in okay. there, you two. Joan's gonna figure out what to do with you. She's making a huge mistake. No, you made a mistake when you murdered Lonnie. Hey, everybody just take a breath, all right? I was just trying to tell them- And that's your mistake right there. You can't fight everybody. Understand that Joan's not looking for revenge. She just wants order. Cooperation is the name of the game. There's still a way through this, but you've you got to let Joan says. enforce the laws. You do anything she tells you to do, huh? Go along with whatever she says just to keep your place. It's not like that. Joan's got a tough job. She needs all our help to keep this place safe. You boys want to make it out of here. Just relax and trust in the process. Okay, so now we're locked up. After I brought you in, after I saved your asses, this is how you treat me? Betrayal? Lies? I'm gonna say Joan's a real enemy. David, I'm not your enemy. We have to figure out what to do about Joan. Joan's betrayal wasn't as bad as yours, little brother. You have any understanding of what they're doing to me? I'm being set up. And I don't even want to think about what hey, they'll Dr. do when Simple they find Kate. How's it going? I could have found a way to protect all of you. But now? Now you're all on your own. You gotta still have some friends here, right? I thought Lonnie was a friend. He turned on me. And you shot him. Any friends you haven't killed, haven't killed you yet. It's everyone out for themselves these days. I'm gonna say stop sulking. Joan played you. And that sucks. I get it. But now you've got to stop sulking and decide what you're going to do about it. I already had a plan and you ignored it. 
I did the best I could. Can't say I never tried. I have always given 100%. Tell that to Kate. Oh, yeah? Tell that to Kate. You left her behind once already. Maybe it's time you try a different way. Shut up! <laughs> Damn. You're dead to me. If we get out of here, you're on your own. I'm through with you. Come on, his ass back. <laughs> Typical so brothers, you. fighting like boys. You bitch. I fucking trusted you! Careful! Don't give him a concussion. I came here to talk, not fight. You're not gonna be a problem, are you? I just want a calm discussion between us. Well, if you let us I go. won't be a problem if you let us go. In fact, I may even be friendly. I'm sorry. I can't do that. <laughs> but I like what you're trying to do. Eh, people had concerns about me coming here after the way you murdered Lonnie, David. But I know what the real danger here is. And you need to hear about it. Let's get to if the you point. know there's trouble out there, just tell us. I'm getting to it. Those raids were unfortunate, but necessary. The real danger was another long winter. I should have been told about this. David, you remember how many friends we lost last year. I couldn't bear to see it happen again. Tomorrow morning, I'm gonna call for a gathering in the square. The people deserve to hear a full explanation of your arrest. And then? Then you'll be replaced as head of security. No one's above the law, David. Not even you. I know the laws, Joan. You're the one breaking them. I'm gonna say that's unfair. David deserves a fair shot. He doesn't need to be replaced. If he was as good as you say, he wouldn't be in this position, would he? You set me up. Everyone's gonna see through your lies. I did what I had to do to keep the people of Richmond safe. They're going to see that. And they'll also see that the biggest threat to them right now is you. Bullshit! I understand you're angry with me, but let's talk about it in private. Bring him with us. Screw this. Gotta get out of here. Okay. Obviously the door's not gonna open, but let's try it. <sighs> Locked. I'm not getting out through here. What's this on the wall? Well, that's about the kind of day I'm having. squeeze through there Ugh, nothing useful here hmm I'm not gonna get up there from this bench you can jump up there I'm gonna need that stool my hand don't want to bust my hand did I grab that thing off the wall been a long time since I hit the showers oh and I could use one 
Too bad there's no running water in here. Can use that pipe. Let me sticks it in his ass. See, it's not in his back pocket or nothing, so where do you put it? Guards. Barely. We gotta get you out of here. Take this. Help me pry these bars off. <clears throat> Shit. Give it a push from your side. There we go. Thanks, Kate. Now, give me a hand. What's all that noise? It's a herd. They've got this place surrounded. Come on. This way. Well, that's even better. We're surrounded by a herd. Where are you taking me? Eleanor found a place. Gabe's there with the others. We've been hiding out there. For as long as we can, anyway. So you sure is safe? How safe is it? Safe enough, for now. But we should hit the road as soon as we can. We should probably keep moving. Where are the patrols? Oh, they're around. I had some close calls on my way to find you. Almost got caught. But I got lucky. I'm impressed. You must be feeling better if you're sneaking around like this. I'm not, really. But... I'll get my rest when we're safe. All clear. Come on. I saw them take David from the quarantine building. Yeah. How's he doing? I can't be his wife anymore. He doesn't deserve to be locked away. Don't, don't second him. guess yourself. We did the right thing. Maybe you're right. I hope David forgives me. Hold up. Close call. I think it's clear. Let's move. Okay, lead the way. I won't catch let us. them catch us, because I'm coming for them first. That well, that's not what like I had in mind. That's the thing I've ever heard, Javi. That's Eleanor's place. There's a lot of activity all of a sudden. I don't like this. Come on, let's get inside. Yeah. 
more sugar bowls. Episode 4, Decker Down Water. Okay, I got the redemption rant time. You know what really grinds my gears? I've been thinking hard about this and parking. I really People can't fucking park for shit. A thing. I'm sorry. Like, when you take up more than one parking I'm spot, how, how do you manage to do that by accident? Obviously, hey, you buddy. did that shit on purpose to be an asshole. It's good to see you, Javi. I can't really? fucking stand people who park and take up more than one space. I didn't expect to find you. Unless you're like in a I RV mean, or a camper, that's understandable. I, thought, I went looking for my dad, but I couldn't find him. I just can't do this now. Oh, hey. Uh, hey. Trip, look who's here. Hey, guys. Uh, hey. <clears throat> Where have you been? Well, someone did that the other day. Hey, uh, Walmart. Joan threw me and David in jail, if you can believe it. Great. So you gave these people more reason to hate us. What is going on here in Richmond? You know more about this place than the rest of us. I'm gonna say we gotta leave. It's dangerous for us here. We've gotta go. That's crazy. We're safer here. Safer than anyone else. Tell that to my brother. He's still in their custody. I want to go save my dad. Right now. He needs our help. I'm going to say no or No leave. way. It's just too dangerous. The best thing for our family is to get out of here. And of course you'd say that. You already tried running away once. Have you guys even looked out the window? Go look for yourself. Yeah, we ain't getting through that. Javi, even if you did get your brother free, you're not going to be able to go anywhere. Wow. As much as I don't want to be here... You sure are glad we didn't stumble into that on our own? <sighs> Fuck. Yeah. Can you imagine? Would have been worth risking it to get away from all this. I'm still a risk to start city. fresh. You and me. That's brave. Stupid. But brave. It seems like we're in danger within this place and without. I, for one, would feel a whole lot safer with a few more guns to protect ourselves. That the smartest move to make right now? That's crazy. I'm gonna say we can't talk our way out. If we're out. really gonna make it out of here, we have to be ready to shoot our way out, right? Yeah, right. Good. I know where there's guns. My dad showed me. There are lots. I can take us. Okay. Sounds like a plan. We'll get back here as soon as we can. Good luck. Ugh. Come here. Kate, I... Just be careful. I'm gonna go grab me a Monster Energy drink. I'm over here about to doze off. Sorry about that. Be right back. some energy real quick yeah I just woke up from a nap and decided to start streaming so I'm still a little groggy Ugh. how do you get that sip Boop. 
For some reason, coffee don't work on me anymore. I guess I drink it too much. I've built an immunity to it. Look, Javi, I, I don't know if you heard us, but I think I fucked it up with Eleanor. We can talk on the way. I, about that, I, I don't think I can leave this apartment with things like this between me and her. It's just Monster, not right. Vodka, my drinking days are I over. I know you must have at least heard something. It happens, especially these days. Don't worry about it. Thanks. Just shouldn't have pushed it with her like I did. Wasn't fair. Too much going on already, right? Javi, come on. Just give us a minute, pal. I'm sorry, buddy. I just I don't know what to do. Hey, my phone was on fire today. Follow just your heart. Just follow your heart. That's all any of us have left anymore, right? Thanks, man. Oh, well, you just started drinking coffee. I'll talk it over with Eleanor and watch over things here. You've got my word. I won't let anything happen to anyone. Thank you. Javi, come on. Good luck. Stay alert. Be careful. Oh. You'll be fine. Okay. This will be great. We got this. Slow Excuse down, me. buddy. I've done this before, Javi. No, you haven't, Gabe. Not really. Some decisions, you make them in a split second, and then have to carry them the rest of your life. You understand? What do you mean, Javi? I'm gonna say walkers don't shoot Just back. be careful. People aren't muertos. They can shoot at you. I know. Then you know to be quiet and stay hidden. So, we stay hidden and quiet? If we could just slip past quietly, it'll make our job a lot easier. Okay. We don't want to make any noise and attract any attention. Hey, I can go talk to him while you sneak inside. I'll distract him. You won't do anything to me. Well, I'm gonna say that's I'll tell him I saw something suspicious. Well, that's a risk. And he'll probably trust you because you're David's son, but I don't... Right. I, I can do this. Gabe, wait! Hey! Oh, hey. I saw something. Show me. That was quick. All right, let's open the door. wasn't so risky. That wasn't what I wanted you to do. Whatever. It was no big deal. Ain't nothing like almost knocking someone on their ass. Boy almost got flushed. It's down here. The guns are through that door. to look for a key either. I have to do this the hard way. That made a whole bunch of noise. I'm 
I'm surprised nobody heard that. Oh, hit the mother load. He stuck a baseball bat up his ass. Put these in your bag. Do you know how heavy an AK-47 is? You wouldn't be able to pick it up like that without the struggle. we never done this before. Just you and me. We make a pretty good team, right? The uncle nephew one two punch. I'm gonna say yeah we do. Yeah we do. Drop it. What the hell are you doing here? What are you doing with all that? We're getting getting guns. guns. What does it look like? Yeah, it was a shit thing to do. Fucking off on me like that. I know. I. Why didn't you meet me at the stronghold? We had a plan. David's in trouble. My brother is in over his head, and the water is rising. He needs our help. You're damn straight he does. But why should I trust you now? As far as I can tell, you're nothing but trouble. We gotta stop because what Joe. Joan is doing is wrong. I guess I can't really say no to that. And it looks like you could use all the help you can get. Awesome. I gotta grab something else real quick. Meet me by the front at five. Okay. I bet you gotta put the plunge on the back of her head to blow her back out. She ain't got no hair to pull. Come here. What was the purpose of that? Get away from me! Uh-oh. Oh no. Oh no. You stabbed me, motherfucker. Javi, you're bleeding. Are you okay? Oh my god. I'm gonna say, what the uh, fuck, Gabe? Damn it, Gabe! Does it fucking look like I'm okay? I'm sorry. Jeez, I can't leave you guys alone for two minutes, can I? He's still alive? Yeah. Just passed out. Starting to think siding with you might have not been the best idea. Toss Sleeping Beauty in the closet so nobody ah. sees him. Oh, I control it. Let me see that wound. It's really bleeding. You're gonna need that taken care of. Shit. No, it's okay. Lingard and David are close friends. We can count on him to help you. Medical facility's right nearby. It'll be quiet this time of night, too. Okay, but let's be quick. Yeah, that would be a good idea, Dark Link. What? While he's out cold. Can they really hit targets over a mile away? Not these, but some models. Javi, it's probably best if Lingard doesn't see these guns. He and David might be tight, but he's still part of Richmond's leadership council. I'll keep watch with Ava. Okay. Do any of them have laser sights? This dude here getting strung up. <gasps> Shit, Javi, what happened to you? Ran into a little trouble. Wow, <sighs> that looks like it must have hurt. I just need to get it cleaned up. You surprised me. Thought you were someone else. 
I thought you left. Thought you'd be long gone by now. <sighs> so did I. But I still need to talk about AJ with Lingard. Look at him. Anyway, I can't leave Richmond with that herd out there. That dude is Something tells me Lingard doesn't care what you're doing. He's been out of it since I got here. He's alive. Poor dumb bastard. That's gonna need more than just cleaning, Javi. I can stitch that for you. I can't promise it'll look great once it heals. You've done this before? Yeah, I have. On myself, actually, in much worse conditions. You'll be fine. Huh. Let me see if I can find a needle and thread for that. Clem, are you okay? I'm fine. I started bleeding. I know, it's a thing. I've traveled with women before, and, and they all had it. What is it? I mean, like, why is it... Oh, she's on her period. Just don't understand. Oh, that. Well, you'll get the hang of it. How? It's exactly like anything else. It, this isn't exactly like anything else. Okay. I can take you back to Kate. She can help you with, uh... Javi, worry about yourself right now. We need to find a needle and thread to stitch you up first. Oh, uh, right. Wake up! Talk to me! Yeah, smack the shit out of him just for the hell of wow. it. Wow, that guy is really out of it. Will you talk? Will you slap him again? Wake up! Talk to me! Dr. Lingard? Dr. Lingard? Dr. Lingard? Can you hear me? Does he look like he can hear you? Penicillin. Not what I'm looking for. Cody. Hmm. Not much left. It looks like painkillers are in high demand. I wouldn't steal any medicine if I were you. It really doesn't go over well. Sorry, phone call. Well, these could come in handy. Jackpot. Needle and thread. All sterilized and ready to go. Here we go. I'll take care of Clem's little bleeding problem. Hey, this is just what you're looking for. They help you handle it. Kate will take care of you. Think I remember how to do this. <sighs> okay, hold still. Try not to breathe. Thank you for, you know, all that I know I'm not the best person for this I always hoped Kate would talk to Mariana and I'd just be there for support you weren't so bad was basically all this means is you could become a mom if you wanted funny I already felt like a mom even Ava would have to admit I was a good mom to AJ
unlocked house and it wasn't boarded up or nothing. Draw no. Whoa there, Clem. It's just me. What the hell do you want? I know how pissed you are, Clementine. Spitting on David really got that message across. Believe it or not, I'm actually sorry about what happened. It wasn't easy for any of us. I'll get him I'm back. I'm going to get AJ back. You can't keep me away forever. That's just not going to happen, Clem. Look, it's not much, but here. These energy bars. David wanted you to have that. AJ drew it just after you. I'm say thank you. This. Thank you. You're welcome. Consider it a peace offering? We care about you. Just try to remember that even if it feels wrong, people can still be trying to do the right thing by you. Listen, it's dangerous out here, and right now, you're hurting. Whatever you do, you can't let what happened get to you. You need to keep a level head. Plan for after that. You're strong. But that won't get you far if you don't know what you're doing. Or where you're headed. I'll make I can it on, make my, it on own. my own. Just like I always have. I don't need anybody else. I don't blame you. Just don't overestimate what you're actually capable of. For me, staying alive has always been about finding people I could trust as much as they trusted me. That's what the new frontier has been. Oh, I got a stretch. A silver lining. Made me feel worth a damn. Kept me going in the worst of times. <sighs> You'll find yours. I know you will. Someone or something. I used to have I Lee. I used to have Lee. You never mentioned him. He took care of me for a while. Every time I would look at AJ, I could hear him in my head, helping me, guiding me. He's still with you, you know, here. So is AJ. From the first time we met, right here, surrounded by absolute hell. You and AJ were a light in the darkness. Hope for a better world. That's who you are. Promise me you'll never lose that light. Please. I'm gonna say I it's promise. It makes you special, Clem. Okay, I promise. You're a tough kid. Don't change. <sighs> I should get back before anyone notices I'm gone. I know you said you'd get by on your own, but if you find yourself needing supplies or just someone to talk to, there's an old airfield about 10 or so miles south of here. Prescott. There are good people there. I'm sure they'll help you out. I'll miss having you around, Clem. I'll shake the hand. You're going to be okay. Thanks, Ava. Good luck out there, Glenn. That's what keeps me going. There's things I have to stay alive to do. Homie over there strung out. <sighs> so, what do you think? I owe think you I'm one. getting better. I owe you one. Add it to the pile.
You coming? I still have to ask Lingard about AJ. <sighs> Hello, Clementine. Javier. Thought you were rotten in a cell with David. There any chance he got out too? I hate to think about what Joan might do to him. None of your it's business. none of your business. There's... There's no need for that tone. I look like someone who... who gives a shit what you're up to. Frankly, I've had enough of backstabbing to last me a lifetime. Why do you care if David got out? He deserves what's coming to him. If you think that, you don't know David. I know he's the reason I lost AJ. When AJ recovered, David was the one who stepped up. Took personal responsibility for that kid. You say that like it's a good thing. I really doubt he was a positive influence. David's the reason the kid's better off now than, than he's ever been. You can be as mad as you want about how, AJ how do things pan out. Clem is AJ's family. No kid is better off when you break their family apart. Maybe you're right. Maybe AJ should be with Clem. All I know is that he's better than he was when he got here. No thanks to you or David. I stand by what I said. If David's taken such good care of him, why did he tell me to ask you where AJ is? That's what this is about, then. You... You want to know where the boy is? What do you want? I... I just want to die. I want you to inject this into me. You're crazy. Are you crazy? That's just the way it is. When your brother found me, he... He got me to care about everything I'd given up on. My life, other people, even this goddamn place. Without him around, I don't want to care anymore. Just tell me where he is! Then you won't have any reason to do it. You kill him, he's gonna turn. All right, I'll do it. Well, where is he? He's... He's at the McCarroll Ranch. A few miles west of here. He's really alive. Don't forget to stick around to handle the after part. I don't want to become one of those monsters. Don't forget, Joan's looking for you and your friends. You better hope she doesn't find you. Oh, look on the back I've got right side. The zombie will be, uh... Well... The zombie won't be. I was gonna say, the zombie's gonna be too strong up on drugs to do anything. <laughs> Finally. Oh! Hey! Uh, hi, Clementine. Surprised to see you here. Yeah. Right back at you. You all good? Yeah. We're all set. Let's roll. Mm, good to see you. Huh. 
Javi, you're back. And Clementine. Thanks for the warm welcome. Just surprised to see you is all. Guys, this is Ava. Oh She's... yeah, I know who she is. She's got a hell of a punch. Nice to meet you. Good to see you, Ava. Oh, hell. You okay? Yeah. It looks worse than it is. Don't worry about it. Kate's lying down in the other room for a bit. So you got the guns, huh? We got them, all right. One for you, and one for you. I saved this one for you. No, I've already got one. Actually, it wouldn't hurt to have another. Thanks. Oh. So what took you so long? We went to see Dr. Lingard. At night? I'm kind of surprised he was sober. It's gotta be a stressful job. He's dead Looking now. after an entire community? Actually, Lingard's dead. Oh my god. He asked me to help him end it, so I helped him. I... I had no idea things had gotten that bad for him. He was done. With all this. Why don't you go talk to the hell out of my shoulder? Okay. Okay. The sun will be rising in a few hours. Jones people know we're holed up here, and they're gonna come looking for us. All of us. Ah, for fuck's sake. Maybe it's not as bad as we think. Fucking figures. And there's no going anywhere with those things blocking our exit. They like me, that has to help somehow. Just because they like you, doesn't mean they're gonna like the rest of us. We're sitting ducks up here. I know, I know. We're fucked, okay? Oh, thanks for that, Javi. Like we don't know that already? We can't just cut and Whoa, run. Not with true. the herd out there. Like it or not, we're fucking stuck in Richmond. Now how the fuck are we gonna put the brakes on this thing? Joan and her people are going to be at the square, right? We need to bring the fight to them. We go after Joan, our problems are solved. Great. So, how do we do that? It's a good question. Joan will probably have a full security detail with her. Return She'll be insulated the power. from us and from anybody in Richmond who doesn't agree with what she's doing. The best way to get rid of Joan is to get David back on top. If he's in charge again, things will go back to the way they used to be. No arguments here. After we take Joan out, we're gonna need some way out of this mess. I don't know about the rest of you, but I'm not much of a runner. We've got a truck, a big one, that we used to use for walker defense. It's a little busted up, but it's way better than nothing. People are gonna be patrolling these streets looking for us. How far away is this truck? I'll show you. We've been expanding, pushing out further, making the safe zone even bigger. Can't promise you they've cleared all the walkers yet, but that's where the truck's parked. <laughs> I could spit and hit it. We steal that thing, nothing will be able to stop us. Steal what? Hey. Jesus, Javi, is that blood on your shirt? You just not realize you that? You said it wasn't that bad. It isn't. How the hell did this happen? Oh, you're bleeding right through I that bandage. Things went a little sideways at the end. Gabe got in the way. A guard came after me and he stabbed me in the shoulder. Oh, I thought you guys were going to be careful out there. Hey, don't worry about it. It is what it is. Thought you knew what you were doing. You're still alive, aren't you? Eleanor, can you take a look at this? As long as he keeps it clean, it should be okay. Would you guys stop making such a big deal about it? It happened. It's over. Move on already. I'm just trying to make sure he's okay, Gabe. What we need to be talking about is the plan. Oh, I have a bunch of ideas. I want to be the one to go after Dad. Just... Give me a gun and I'll do whatever. I know the town. I know what Dad's gonna be thinking. Just slow hey, down. Hey, 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 slow down, would you? You're getting way ahead of yourself. Who's to say you're even coming along, kid? Are you fucking kidding me? Ugh, this is bullshit! I'm not staying behind. Gabe, take a breath. He's my dad. I'm going. It's going to be dangerous out there, and I don't want anyone else getting hurt. If we get to save Dad, then getting hurt is worth it. It's worth dying for.
This is more important to me than anyone else. No one's gonna die. I've got a gun, and I know how to use it. No way anybody is dying. Not today. That's why we have to take the time to talk it through. So everybody comes out okay. Nobody here is gonna let you be a martyr, Gabe. Your life is precious. Life is precious? Then how come you shot Conrad, huh? Back in the tunnel, when he came after us, he tried to bargain with you. But you thought killing him would be easier. I saved your life too, in case you didn't remember that this part. Man is a little so snitch. what? You shot him. You killed him. What the fuck, Javi? Is she telling the truth? You murdered my friend? What the fuck did you do that for? You looked me in the eyes, he man. Him. He had a gun on them. If I hadn't killed him, he was gonna shoot Clementine and Gabe. He's telling the truth. When Conrad found out that I used to run with New Frontier, he went crazy. He would have pulled the trigger, no question. I guess we'll never know, right? Because he's not here to tell his side of things. You made sure of that. Looks like you're a pretty fucking dangerous person to be around, Avi. First you kill my friend, then you get me and my friends on Joan's shit list? Uh-oh. I think you need to give us some space, Javi. Fuck that. I don't want to see you ever again. Well, maybe I'd be better off with Joan. At least I know she wants to stab me in the back. You get the fuck out and you stay gone, or I can't be held accountable. You feel me? We can take care of ourselves. Don't go to hell. Fuck off. All of you. If you don't think I fucking agonized about it, then you can all go to hell. We better go get that truck. I'll uh, get my stuff, then call you on the walkie when I see things getting started in the square. Clem, you come with me to get the truck. <sighs> Gabe and Kate, you guys hang back here. Be ready for anything. I see what's going All on. All right, let's see the truck. You're punishing me because I told everyone what you did, right? Screw that. I'm going to get the truck. You stay behind and keep watch. Go around, you proved it. your fucking point already, Gabe. Now it's time to grow up and help us. Hey, Gabe, come on. I need you to watch my back on this one. Yeah, okay. I guess pussy somebody needs to be a lookout. What? Nothing. Gabe and I will be fine back here. Okay, I see where to go. I'm not talking the game. That's not a pretty sturdy looking fence. Gotta be careful. Any more muertos pushing? Those boards won't hold up. Slow for an escape. Yeah, Gabe is a bitch. Guess they'll be using that for construction once they've cleared this area. There it is. Let's go. Chances. I'd say about 50 50. Smart ass. 
more people wake up. What are we gonna do? We can't start the engine. Not without attracting a lot of attention. Kate, you steer. The rest of us are gonna get behind the truck and push. See if we can't get some distance between us and them. Smart idea. Ready? Ready. Ready. That's a pretty light truck. Oh, an armored vehicle. Turns out you needed me after all, huh? I'm just saying, I know you didn't want me to come Let's along. Just push the truck. Just push the damn truck. All right. What do you think I'm doing? I'm doing all the work. You're the one trying to have a conversation here. That's more like it. Don't think those guys will be able to hear the engine all the way over here. I put it in neutral. Couldn't find an ignition key in there. Guess you'll have to hotwire it. Try not to shock yourself. Shit. I'll need something to strip the wires. They left all their supplies lying around. Bet there'll be some tools out there somewhere. Just try to hurry, okay? Why could I use a knife? There we go. Oh, I'm <laughs> here. oh shit! shit. I did not see that one coming. Almost there. Keep an eye out while I get it started, okay? I'll check on the guys in the office. Clem and I will look out for walkers. Okay. Here goes. Should help with this. Uh, I hope I cut the wrong, I mean, the right wire. Got to connect the battery to the ignition. Battery is blue. Let there be light. Oh, shit. Whose idea was aborted up like that anyway? Oh, shit. The square is a couple of blocks away. This is a good place to wait. Do we have enough gas? I'm not about to turn the engine off again. What now? We wait for Ava to call us on the walkie. So, nothing for us to do but 
Sit and watch the sun come up. Yep. Well, I know we've got something important to do. I'm teaching you to play Euchre. <sighs> That's not a real thing. It's a card game. Come on, it's fun. It's nice to be driving around with a couple kids in the back seat again. Really takes you back, doesn't it? Those are good right. times. This is nice. I'm trying to crack my I just bag. close my eyes. We're right back uh, where we were. There we go. All of us together. Do what I do. Try to think about the nice stuff. Not everything that happened after. <laughs> gotcha. Oh, come on. That's not even a good rule. Still gotcha. Guess he stopped playing it cool with her. Hmm? Uh, in case you haven't noticed, Gabe's got a little crush on Clementine. He yeah, light kind of likes her. Out. You get it? Well, okay, I, sort of I hope it works out for them. Okay, so I really do. They're good for each other. I think. Think their first official date will be target practice? Then skinning and eating a wild animal. Uh, young love. It's so normal, you know? Like, as crazy as things get, as terrible and tragic and just plain stupid, there's nothing more wonderfully ordinary as two kids falling for each other. Not that they're there yet, but to feel something that... I'm gonna take a quick restroom break, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Take another sip off my drink. Ugh. Check my achievements. Gamer score 580 out of 1,000. Achievements 21 out of 30. Okay, not bad. And slave for another person? Kind of like the best drug there is. Is it bad if I kind of envy them? Those early days, before you get up the courage to say exactly what's on your mind? You never get those back, do you? No. No, you don't. It's unfair. <sighs> That's all I'm saying that they're feeling what they're feeling right now, and when that sun gets a little higher, it's right back to the fight. I just wish he could have had a childhood, you know? I wish I could have given them that. Him and Mari, both. They deserved better than this. Now you did the best you could, Kate. You kept this family alive as long as you possibly could. It counts for a lot. I hope you know, Javi, having you there with me, right by my side, all this time. That's what made the difference. You're so sure of what you're doing all this for. You didn't run away. You could have. I'm gonna say people need me. I'm here so I can set an example for people. For Gabe especially. Someone to be proud of. Someone who sticks around. I get it. There's no graceful way to say this, so I'm just gonna say it. I know we've had moments, you and I. 
And they're always a little hot and a little confusing and maybe some of them haven't meant anything at all. But before whatever happens tomorrow happens, I need you to know whatever this thing is between us, I want to give it a chance. And I know the fact that David is back in our lives now makes this whole thing a little more I thought he was already clapping David's wife. But do you feel the same way? I'd really like to know. I'm gonna say hell yeah. Let's go for it. We gotta try, right? Oh my god, really? Really. So are we gonna... We gonna fuck. Okay. Yeah. Shit. We're doing this. You do realize we're gonna have to have a weird conversation with David, <laughs> right? David's a cook. It's the right way to play this. He already got the sense I was pulling away. I just so want to be able to tell him route. in person. It'll feel better that way. That would be the stand-up thing to do in this situation. Can I just say how lame doing the stand-up thing is, though? Oh, it's super lame. Javi, it's an execution over here. She's planning to hang David in front of the whole crowd. You've got to get over here now. Don't uh -oh. bring the truck. If they see it, they'll kill him right away. If you can just get into the square... Shit. We gotta get over there. Now. I'm going to hang back here. With the truck. Keep the walkie close by. We'll tell you as soon as we've got David. Good luck. Nothing else from Ava? Nope. And it sounds like a crowd out there. It sounded like Ava got cut off by something. Or somebody. Wish we had some idea of what we're heading into. Like, is the whole plan shot? Or did she just have a little setback? Maybe the walkie died. could be having problems with the walkie-talkie. Maybe it's out of range, or ran out of batteries or something. Maybe. We're not gonna know what went wrong until we actually do this thing. So, let's do it already. You ready? We just have to remember. We're people, not muertos. We're smarter than they are. And we need to act like it. Exactly. We've got to take the time to think things through. For the others, can we? For years now, Richmond has been governed by one simple principle strong council, strong community. But unfortunately, the actions of one of the members of that council, our security expert, David Garcia, have put us all. She's in lying to all of you! I'm sorry to have to show you this. Truly, I am. But you all need to see. Just look what he's done. Damn. He murdered these men in cold blood. I saw him murder Lonnie with my own eyes. Some of the best men I ever knew cut down in their prime. Is this who we want in charge? Someone this reckless. This cruel? Not if I have anything to do with it. I can't believe this is really happening. She's gonna kill him. She can't do this to him. I'm gonna say this He's kept war. him safe. I knew Joan was willing to fight dirty, but this is taking it to the next level. We gotta be ready to match her game. I think you're right. Javier! I heard you were planning to crash our little party. Why don't you come on up here? Show your face to everyone. 
I'm sure these people would like to hear what you have what to say. What the hell, Joan? Fuck that, and fuck you, Joan. I don't have anything to say to someone who shit talks my family. Don't make this harder on yourself, Javier. Get up here. Now. She knows we're here now. We might as well. We both know you killed Dr. Lingard. Why, Javi? Why would you do that to us? The only surgeon in a hundred mile radius, but you didn't care about that. Well, option A. Lingard saw what was happening in Richmond, what you were trying to do, and he didn't want any part of it. He asked me to spare him the sight of all this. You ask me, he's better off. Sorry if I don't take your word for it. Too bad you killed the only man who could back up your story. I had a very interesting conversation with your friend Eleanor last night. She was the one who alerted us to David's plot against Lingard. Isn't that right, Eleanor? We did. She said you came here because you wanted to save your brother. You backstabbing Admiral, bitch. Almost. Don't know how you thought you were going to pull it off. Considering it's all of us against the three of you. And that's exactly what I'm planning to do. Appreciate the honesty. Which makes this so much harder. Here in Richmond, people who put themselves before the group don't last long. Bring them out. Get away from me. You're making a mistake. Ava! Oh no, they had them this whole time. David wanted to tear this whole place down. He told his people where to find our gun supply, and sure enough, they picked us clean. You really thought you could ride into town and stage a coup? With our own damn weapons? Something like that? I can't just let it go. You've put me in a no-win situation here, so I'm gonna do the same thing to you. Both of them deserve to die for their crimes. However, Javi, I'll let you spare one of them. Just one. No! Hell no! Joan! Don't! Not after what they tried Please to do. Please don't do this. Oh, you may take be guilty me of bringing them into this, but they chose to go along with it. If you're gonna punish anyone, it should be me, not them. So ready to sacrifice yourself for others. Don't worry, Javi. I'm not through with you yet. Joan, are you sure about this? We never agreed to killing all these people. It's really up to Javi, isn't it? All eyes are on you. Maybe this will help you make up your mind. Boys? <gasps> Come on, Javi. Who's it gonna be? Your friend? Or your brother's lieutenant? Oh. Uh. Shit. Shit. Oh, come on! This is fucking stupid. You can't be serious. God damn you, Joe. Uh, I wish I had the options to let people vote. Do the right thing, Javi. Let Ava live. She's always been loyal. Javi! No! Well, there's the Javi I know. Backstabbing, double-crossing, no-good, dirty fucking murder. Such language. But I admire the sacrifice you're making here, Javi. Shoot her. Wait! I said don't shoot Ava! You did, but there's something else you need to understand. Betrayal. Joan, think about what you're doing. Ava's one of us. You can't fucking do this. This is fucked. I can do anything I want. You brought this on yourself. Do it. Joan. Damn. No! Oh my god. They really shot her. Oh, god damn it. Now, David, it's your turn. I can't believe this. This isn't how we do things. This is madness. Stop, Stop her, Clint. Her, Clint. Is this the process you trusted? No! Think about this, Javi. You know what's gonna happen here. You ready for that? 
We don't murder in Richmond. We exile. That's how we've always done things. How about you take David and the rest of your people and just get the hell out? Go far away from Richmond, and then whatever you do is up to you. I'm sure the herd outside would like that. She thinks she's sending us out there to die. She's counting on it. Everybody, put your guns away. We're going to handle this peacefully. Don't listen to them, Javi. They're fucking butchers, all of them. Shoot that bitch! Take her out! She deserves it. If you don't do it, I fucking will. Go to hell, Joan. There we go. Dad! You've got to get over there before... Before... Oh, fuck. Kate! Well, that completes episode four. Uh, next stream will be on Monday. It'll be the finale. All right, this is the Trigger Trey from the Good Old Killer Instinct Squad. I'm about to end the stream. Uh, before I do, let me see who I can raid. Let me see who's online. Okay, LED Kiki baby. 
I guess I can raid her. Shout out to Darkling Vortex, thanks for modding. I'll take care of you later. 